All right, everybody. So in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to sharpen up the lawnmower blade. Now these things are pretty beat up. Like these are pretty bad. They're pretty much beyond repair. As you can see, there's a bunch of chunks missing here, but we're gonna sharpen them up anyhow. Now I use this for a lot of bush hogging type stuff. So I'm just gonna sharpen them up the best I can. Now these are not, I don't use these for lawns and I'll show you what I use for lawns here in a minute. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it in the vise like so. Make sure it's level and make sure it's good and tight. All right, now next what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a rag. If you have a wire brush, this works too. We're just gonna clean off the, the, the grass that's on there just to get it out of the way. <clears throat> now this is just an eight inch file, uh, double-sided, uh, cross cut. It's a normal, typical file that you can get at Lowe's or Home Depot for a couple dollars. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna start off by taking off the top a couple and then coming in the back and taking off one now that's to make it so it's not sharp and doesn't cut your finger so next we're going to come at an angle we're going to follow the angle that's already here and then we're just going to go across like this nice even don't stop in the middle like that otherwise you're going to get a burr right there so nice even strokes all the way through And there you go. Nice, sharp, and then if you want to take it down so it doesn't cut your finger, you just go once the other way, just like that. And that's not gonna cut your finger. So then you do the other side, you just flip it over. And do the same thing. This side's pretty much messed up, but we'll still do it. So this is what a typical blade looks like. It's nice and perfectly flat and has, has a nice slope to it right here. Nice blade on it. Now this blade isn't sharp at all. I'm not cutting my finger, nothing like that. So just know that your blades don't have to be razor sharp to cut grass, but they do have to be level and flat. So if there has a bunch of gouges missing in them, you really don't want to use those for grass. Now I do a lot of bush hogging and I hit a lot of plants and uh, trees and stuff. So that's what I use those blades for specifically. And changing your blades only a few minutes. So uh, I have a video on that. You can check it out. It's very easy. Now, these ones are green, but they don't actually have to be green. This is just the, the brand that comes with it. 